Okay, so I'm going to show how I'm doing um, a really quick repetitive task using Stream Deck. So I built these buttons real quick. Um, they just, instead of hitting Command Delete, I just have one button. So I can run all the way down here and do stuff. Um, the one that I just created, this one here, I haven't even named it because it's going to go away, is uh, all it does is it hit, it goes Paste, Save, close and close that's all it does so i'm going to load it up first by going double click on this and um, this is the first thing i'm going to do if, if i want to make this right is start with this black square rectangle maybe make it about that big maybe make it just a tad taller just in case some of these um, letters are taller than what I need. I'm going to hit copy. I want to copy this black thing. And then I want to go save and close. All right. So that was another spam call. Now, if you look up here, see how the, the blue letters are gone. So watch what happens. I'm going to double click. Uh, let's see. Where did, you know what? My uh, stream deck has vanished. I need this to be files. I need it to be this. I'm going to push one time on this button and you'll see what happens. So make that the foreground one button push. See what it did. So it did all those things. It put the black over top of the letters and it saved it and it closed it. So now all I got to do is one button push. Double click, one button push. Uh, you know what? I'm leaving that one. Actually, I'm leaving this one too. See if it'll let me go back. Probably won't. Okay, I'll have to fix that because I need to look at these. Um, some of these I'm going to leave them. Some of these I'm going to change them. Like this. I'm never going to remember PFO. Center, I'm going to leave that. I'm not going to type out four letters in a short in a keyboard shortcut. Um, copy and place, copy lock, copy paste. Yeah, see, some of these don't make sense. I uh, changed all these. Look how easy this is. I just don't want these um, letters on my Stream Deck button to where I start thinking that's what it is because I'm assigning a totally different thing to these Stream Deck buttons. Uh, I'm using a number system for most of it. And then uh, where it's really obvious that you don't need that, that you might as well keep a two-letter code, um, then I'm just leaving it. So that's it. That's all I want to show you. Stream Deck, it's pretty powerful. Um, and the mobile, like so right now, this is the 32-button uh, deck. But if you spend the money, it's only 50 bucks. you get a lifetime license of uh, the mobile. And here's what's creepy. It's awesome. If you have an iPad Pro of any year model, you can open up two windows side by side. So you can have... 64 buttons over here and right beside it another 64 buttons so 128 buttons to press just going to see if i've got anything interesting here start work do 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 utilities look how much space there is left and what i found is it whatever stream decks near my left hand i put the most used stuff in the bottom left hand corner so when you see chief that's what's going on i use these the most and then uh, that happens to be the 32 button one that's on my left hand so on the right side i have to take my hand off the mouse to push a button it's still faster than two keys unless the keys are the same letter like if you do ll or qq or whatever but that's it